Our next speaker is Lynn Jenkins, U.S. Representative. Lynn. Well, I too am delighted to be here uh, for many reasons. Uh, one that will take a, a back seat uh, to the announcement that sh soon will be made, and that was that a United States Senator just kept his remarks to two minutes. Uh, I, I know now why Senator Roberts isn't here, <laughs> perhaps. <laughs> Uh, but I, I am uh, so delighted to be here at the premier research and treatment facility uh, for today's big announcement. And I am honored to share representation of KU in Congress uh, with Congressman Yoder. And I am often uh, seen in Washington talking about my proud Kansas heritage. I'm a sixth generation Kansan, raising the seventh generation in Kansas. Uh, my roots go back to President Buchanan, who signed the deed to the home place. Uh, uh, John Ice, a professor at KU, wrote about the Hig family coming to Kansas in sod and stubble. My uh, Higley relatives uh, wrote the words to the state song, Home, Home on the Range. Uh, but what I rarely discuss is another family heritage, and that's one that I share with nearly every American family, and that is a history of cancer. I remember my great-grandmother struggling with cancer, both of my grandparents, uh, both of my parents. My mother, two different battles, uh, both breast and colon. And I am thankful every day for the doctors and the nurses uh, that took care of them and the treatments, but even more uh, thankful to the researchers and their advancement in medicine and the technology that ultimately allowed them to beat their illness. And today, millions of Americans continue to fight cancer, and I hope for a cure each day. Uh, an NCI designation would allow KDU to continue to recruit and train the next generation of top-notch professionals to Kansas. I join uh, my colleagues in congratulating the, the individuals that uh, Congressman Yoder uh, referred to in this proud accomplishment. Thank you.